so hey guys welcome back to my channel hope you're doing extremely well and this is your very own mass code this side so the question of the day is juggler sequence and the question is really easy and i would not even require a pen tab to write and explain right the question is really easy how will i solve it okay the question says that we have been given a series of integers in which the first term starts with a positive integer this positive integer is given to us as n i hope there is no problem in understanding that okay now the next term will be if the next if this term is even the next term will be its square root otherwise it will be the square root of its cube right okay now we have to make the vector of the series until the last term is 1 as you can see if i have been given 9 9 is my odd value so 9 to the power 3 by 2 is 27 27 is again odd 27 to the power 3 by 2 is 140 140 to the power 140 is even so it is it uh, its square root will be actually equals to 11 point something so i am taking the nearest integer 11 11 is again odd 36 36 is even 36 uh, is a perfect square with the 6 added square root so 6 6 is uh, lying somewhat between 2 and 3 so 2 the, uh, the gif and 2s will be something between 1 point something you know, some, suppose 1.41 so that will be converged to 1 and as i got my 1 i will be returning my this vector okay the question is actually very simple so what will i do i will create a vector of int let us name it as answer and my first element is my n that is given to me as input now what will i do i will use a loop uh, let me take that int previous value is equals to n okay just for the sake of comp uh, writing of the code now while my prev is not equals to 1 that is this is the condition that i have want my last value to be 1 what will i say i will say that if n if prev percentile 2 if prev percentile 2 equals to equals to 1 that means my previous value is odd in that case i have to push in that cubic square root the cubic square root so i will say answer dot push back what will i push back i will push back the square root of the power of previous to the power 3 right okay else i will just push the square root so answer dot push back square root of previous now after both these operations anyone will operate if it is odd it will this will operate if this is even this will operate now after that i will have to operate my previous also the previous now becomes answer dot back and then i will return i will just return my answer this is the whole code and this is actually very easy and i don't think that this requires much attention also right let us try to combine and run it it is running fine for the submit also it will run fine if you if you have already subscribed to my channel and i really want to apologize because i was not able to bring the previous two days videos i hope you uh, get what i am i'm like i my schedule was really busy and i was not able to bring that out for you so, so sorry for that but that will not happen in the near future again so i am ready to apologize once again okay so let us end it here and you can see 148 district thank you for watching have a nice day bye